Hi, this is uh, Fabi VA2 app, and uh, together we're we're gonna take a uh, a quick look at uh, how to use stubs and uh, the usefulness of uh, stubs in a Nessu 2R uh, environment uh, during contests. Um, what we generally use is uh, okay. We have the two radios. Uh, one of them at this uh, point is. Uh, is on 15 meters, the other one is on uh, 20 meters. Uh, for what we want to do is to cure the uh, the second harmonic uh, which is offending the uh, receiving radio whenever transmitting on uh, one of the two. Um, what's happening is that uh, the uh, the rig will produce a second harmonic and uh, we, we take care of those uh, uh, using um, uh, filters uh, what we see here, this is a uh, an ICE 419B filter. They do a good job. Each uh, of the two radios uh, is equipped uh, with uh, with one, uh, but of course there's a limitation to what uh, uh, this filter can actually uh, do. Whenever using the rig alone, barefoot, uh, they do a good job in attenuating the uh, the harmonic coming from the uh, the other the transmitting radio. But once you get past that, and uh, if you use an amplifier, well, uh, the amplifier itself uh, will produce uh, uh, harmonics, of course, and uh, we need something past the amplifier and before the antenna uh, to filter out uh, the, uh, the interference. Uh, now, there are, there are some, uh, some, uh, some filters uh, which, uh, which are high power filter. They come with a price tag, of course. The other way is to use uh, a coax uh, uh, stubs. Uh, so, what I did is that uh, I'm using at this point uh, four, uh, four stubs uh, per station. And uh, in order to use these stubs, uh, what you want to do is uh, before at, at the at the um, at the output of uh, either your uh, PA or the uh, the ATU, um, what you use is basically a T connector, which connects onto your ATU. Now one of these will go to the stub system, and the other one will go to the antenna. Um, now the stubs here uh, to make uh, you know something practical and a good use of uh, of stubs. What I did is uh, I used what I had, and I had uh, someplace uh, hidden in the shack uh, one of these uh, remote uh, uh, antenna switches uh, that uh, we see here, and uh, basically uh, you can. From uh, the uh, the switch, select the different stubs. For instance, uh, right now this and uh, this radio is on 15 meters, so we have uh, uh, this is connected right now to the 15 and 40 meter uh, band uh, stub, and uh, it will null 10 and 20 meters. So the other radio being on 20 meters. The, this is the stub I want to use for this radio. Basically, you 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 can switch around and and, and use the one uh, you want. This is pretty useful, I found, uh, in order to 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 make something neat and easy to uh, easy to use. Uh, nothing too fancy, of course, uh, but uh, functional. Um, on the other radio, um, again, I used uh, what I had and. Uh, I had one of these uh, antenna switches. This is a uh, uh, fully manual, of course, and uh, and basically you you do the same thing and select uh, the stub that uh, that you want to use uh, simply manually like this, and the stubs are located right behind, right there. You can you can bundle the stubs all together, it won't make a difference, you won't hurt nothing. Um, the only thing is that maybe uh, it is uh, it is uh, a good a good option, a good good uh, good idea to to use RG213 and not uh, a cheaper 
uh, a coax like RG58. Um, the reason being uh, that uh, they, they will uh, actually give a much better attenuation, which should be in the order of about uh, 28 dBs. Uh, so another 28 dBs uh, attenuation will, will take care of uh, uh, a good portion of the uh, interference coming from the uh, transmitting uh, radio. So this is a quick uh, look at uh, the, uh, uh, the way I use the uh, stubs. And there you have it. Um, I'll post on the uh, website pretty soon a little section on uh, how to cut stubs. Uh, it's, you'll see it's pretty, pretty easy, straightforward uh, process. It just takes a little time, a little patience, and eventually you'll have your stub. Once they're set, they're set uh, for your setup uh, forever. And, uh, and they do a good job. So I hope you liked it and uh, it was somewhat useful to you. Uh, as it is to me. Uh, this is uh, VA2UP saying 7-3.